When I set up an audit group in the industry before joining NSF, there was a real shortage of high quality training for auditors. Training with a focus on GMP as the auditing standard and the skills and tools needed to do this challenging job. A few years ago, in response to the introduction of ICHQ10, a team of us at NSF carried out a detailed review of our auditor training course against the latest quality system guidance and saw an opportunity to get the course certified by IRCA as an independently recognised training with the potential for certification for pharmaceutical auditors in our industry working to GMP. This course was certified in 2011 by IRCA as the first pharmaceutical quality management system lead auditor course using GMP as its standard. Based on GMPs, including PICS, the course is offered globally and is often attended by regulators, QPs and professional auditors. This course helps. It helps the auditor, the industry and the auditor's business. IRCA, the International Register of Certificated Auditors, is the leading professional body for management systems auditors. Our mission is to inspire and empower auditors and auditor training organisations worldwide to achieve excellence, to make a positive and profound contribution to the audit profession, and to achieve excellence and promote the value auditors add to businesses. Each year, over 60,000 students attend an IRCA certified auditor training course. These courses are skills focused, requiring auditors to learn and practice the skills they'll need. They're student learning focused and interactive. IRCA certified training courses are also demanding. They're designed to challenge students and training providers have to go through a stringent approval process to meet and maintain the highest standard of teaching. That's why students, businesses and stakeholders can have confidence in IRCA providers and IRCA trained auditors. They're the best in class. With the globalisation of the pharmaceutical supply chains, there's been an increasing regulatory focus on the quality of audits performed of various manufacturers and suppliers that are in these complex supply chains. And this has highlighted the woeful inadequacy of some of the audits conducted. All regulators globally have an increased focus on the skills and the experience and the training of the auditors. I worked with my colleagues here in NSF to develop this GMP pharmaceutical auditor course that could be certified by IRCA. The MHRA have been very supportive of this since and it is a significant step forward for the pharmaceutical industry as this certification allows the pharmaceutical auditors to demonstrate their ability to audit in a GMP context which has to consider the risks, not just the compliance. As well as improving the quality of audits, this course also adds value by training auditors to build relationships with the audited company, while still completing an objective and fair audit. Exams are never enjoyable, and I know about this one from personal experience. However, the assessment at the end of this course does provide a benchmark and marks a significant step in the journey to becoming an IRCA accredited auditor. Audits and the actions companies take based on the audit findings are so significant. For example, to award a contract for a pharmaceutical manufacturer, to recall a product or not. It's basic good business sense to use auditors who have been trained and accredited to a professional international audit standard. As an auditor, I'm often the most visible contact between the organisation that I represent. And I want to represent that organisation in the best possible way and to build up a relationship with the auditee. I can honestly say in, in more than 40 years of working in the pharma industry, I've never met an individual or a company that deliberately wants to do something wrong. Part of our role as auditors should be to help the auditee to get it right. At the end of the day, we should all have the same goal of protecting patients, but also doing this in a scientifically sound and cost-effective way. The NSF course is, is, in my opinion, the best course that's available. Um, you're in a safe environment, there's, there's no stupid question. 
you are uh, surrounded by experts from the industry who've, who've, who've been, seen it, done it, they know exactly what a good auditor is and what a bad auditor is, and they're there um, for all day in the evenings, and you can ask any question you like, and it's, it's invaluable to have that experience on hand. I'm here to make sure that the course maintains its high standard and that we follow the IRCA criteria so that we keep our certification. Generally, I'm the first point of contact for delegates asking about our public courses and for clients who want us to deliver a course on site for them. All delegates receive very comprehensive course materials and where possible we help them through the IRCA application process. Our tutors support the delegates throughout the course to provide them with the best possible chance of passing the exam. We also offer a number of training courses that follow on from our IRCA certified course to assist delegates to maintain their CPD. Personally, I think from the, the course that I've attended, I think they've kind of exceeded my expectations, really, in terms of, of the, the sort of calibre of people we've gone actually doing the course itself. I think to have, um, particularly for the pharmaceutical industry, ex-MHRA inspectors um, that are actually taking the course, um, people with the, the kind of um, amount of experience they have, uh, I think it's, it's absolutely priceless, yeah. I would really recommend NSF. There's a lot more I think, participation with the groups than maybe I first anticipated, which is good because it breaks it up and um, it's not quite people the tutor just talking to. I think one of the interesting things about the course is that because it's such an international course, there's people from all sorts of different industries, different countries, and you end up learning a lot about the way people operate in different areas, uh, and that's, that's been quite valuable as well. I think the support right from the beginning right through to on the day has been fantastic, very friendly and um, helpful and, and nothing's been too much trouble.